Harry People's Fintech Landscape Exhibition aims to showcase Uganda's remarkable journey in financial technology and celebrate the profound impact of fintech in fostering financial inclusion throughout the country. We also promise to keep making rules and policies that help better the environment for the startups, financial technology companies, and digital financial services across the economy. The exhibition is a culmination of a remarkable initiative called 40 Days 40 Fintechs. This public engagement campaign provided a platform for showcasing 43 innovative fintech companies. These companies have played a pivotal role in transforming Uganda's fintech space and have been instrumental in driving financial inclusion and digital transformation. We are very excited about seeing a lot of fruits happening as a result of continuous advocacy, as a result of setting a number of examples that help many users, innovators, regulators and all the other players get to speed in making sure that we work in ways that help all of us as players in the economy maximize our digital dividend. By leveraging fintech, innovators in Uganda have enabled faster and more secure transactions, expanded access to mobile banking, and encouraged the adoption of digital payment systems. I would advise any innovator coming into our space to one, understand who they are coming to look for. Because you see, like for us, we have specifically narrowed down our targets to this corporate worker who has an emergency. But there is an opportunity in this Chikugo guy who makes 20,000, 50,000, 30,000 every day. You know, if we were to speak from an African point of view, a lot of the technologies we use, a lot of the products that we reproduce have come from a certain setting. They are built to deal with a middle class that is um, urbanized, that is salaried, that gets their money through. Their money comes electronically, so the money starts in the bank. Here, most money doesn't start in the bank, so all of our competition is cash. Uh, right. Everyone here will talk about we're trying to digitize, but we're trying to digitize someone who has cash. As a Ugandan, I can never leave my home without cash. Looking ahead, industry experts predict continued growth in Uganda's fintech sector. With the burgeoning tech savvy population, increased internet penetration, and a supportive regulatory environment, the fintech industry is poised for significant expansion. Charlotte Amuge and Dennis Igor for UBC Business.